Hello Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your reading for the next three months. We're going to take a quick sneak peek at May, June, July. I'm going to do an individual spread for each month. So, all right, let's get started. Okay, all right Scorpio, it could it kind of looks as though there's an important decision that needs to be made in, in regards to a relationship or friendship or some form of partnership here, okay? You guys could either be dealing with someone shady or you yourselves could be doing something shady. It could relate to work or some form of partnership here. Could be romantic, could be work related, could be platonic, okay? Um, I feel like you guys might also potentially decide to take a break from someone around this time in the month of May. I feel like you guys might potentially be feeling like physically, mentally, maybe even emotionally exhausted is what I'm seeing. You guys could potentially be dealing with a Libra cancer um sagittarius here taurus libra i already mentioned libra and any other type of water sign okay financially i would say things are going to go well for you guys if you guys are single it kind of looks as though you guys are going to be enjoying your single life or also some of you guys could potentially be having some form of relationship issues if you guys are coupled okay for those of you who are single um, kind of looks as though, well, for singles or the ones who are taken, maybe that's where the sneakiness comes in, okay? You guys could potentially be approached by someone and then kind of think about whether if you kind of want to be talking to them while you're in a relationship or just all together, you guys might potentially be approached by a water sign, but I feel like this person is kind of sneaky or not to be trusted. Alright, so the next spread is going to be for the month of June. Again, there might be an offer of a new relationship here. Again, financially, you guys are going to be doing well in the month of June. You guys might be spending a lot of time with friends, hanging out, and just enjoying yourselves. Um, I feel like you guys aren't about the drama this month. You guys are really just like, if you guys are in a relationship around this time, it kind of looks as though you guys are going to be pretty happy or like... Everything feels sunny. You guys are probably going to be enjoying the warm weather. You guys might be updating your look, buying yourselves nice things. And it just, for the most part, feels like it has that good vibe to it for the most part. More towards like, I think like maybe the first week might be a little bit stressful for you guys. But the remainder of June looks to be pretty good, I would say. Also, I feel like you guys are manifesting money. You guys may be finding either alternative ways to make money or you guys are going to be doing really well in regards to finances. Again, you guys could potentially be leaving something around this time. Maybe it relates to some form of institution. It could be like a job, a school, something like that, okay? So that's what I have for you in the month of June. Scorpio, let's continue to the month of July. For the month of July, be careful not to be like too naive because it might cost you something. Like it might either cost you money or it might cost you like a relationship or you being ignored by someone. Um, again, there's some form of upheaval occurring around this time. It could again relate to either someone being really indecisive regarding something, someone having options in regards to dating. Someone could potentially find messages regarding like someone communicating with other people outside of the relationship. Again, there might be information or secrets coming out. It seems like to be a recurring theme for some reason for a lot of the signs. You guys could either feel a little bit emotionally off balance and energetically off balance or you could also be dealing with a female who's emotionally off balance or who's coming off as kind of like moody, selfish, something like that, kind of snobby. Um... This could also be your partner if you guys are coupled around this time. Kind of looks as though you guys might feel frustrated because there might be some instances where things aren't going the way you would have liked or you kind of run into a little streak of bad luck here. Again, there might be some form of information that was kind of hidden coming to the surface. I might just kind of take you by surprise. It might swoop in really fast at the beginning of July. Could relate to an Aries here. You could possibly either ghost someone or someone ghosts you around this time. Maybe because they have options. You guys are also going to be very involved in work in the month of July. 
but finances still look stable as well okay so that's essentially what i'm getting for you scorpio i hope you guys like these videos if you guys did like share and subscribe if you guys feel like you guys resonate make sure you guys subscribe and then comment down below okay i like to read your guys's comments so again thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys next time